Hello, Zuko here, and I'm here for my March wrap-up slash April TBR, and I literally just finished this book, and what the fuck? Like, you know that scene in uh, the Silver Linings playbook where the dude just chucks the book out the window while screaming what the fuck? That's how I feel right now. None of my questions were answered. I'm really upset about it. I, I, I spent so much time, I spent so much time reading these books. There were 13 of them, and they didn't answer my, any of my questions. Any of them! Why? I don't understand! Ugh. Like, I don't want to spoil anything in case there's an off chance that some of you haven't read it, or maybe that's why no one has spoiled it for me, because nobody's read it. I don't blame you. I don't know if I would suggest these to you. I'm gesturing down, if you can't tell, to the book that I just threw on the floor, because I'm mad at it. <laughs> I mean, so, uh, I finished the last three books, uh, in the series this month. I mean, okay, it's April 2nd, and I read the last two today and yesterday. So technically I finished them this month, but I don't post videos till Monday. So it, it, we're gonna count it as March. Anyway, uh, <laughs> I read these. I'm mad about it. I don't know, I don't know what to do. Is there a place where I can find all of the missing information? Uh, I don't know what to do. Like, I feel like I've just wasted so much of my time for nothing? There's no answers? Like, I don't understand. <laughs> I just don't understand. I don't know what I'm reading this month. Okay, I'm gonna surprise you at the end of the month. How about that? It's gonna be a surprise so that you can finally escape the treacherous journey that is reading the series of unfortunate events, which is real unfortunate, as I've learned, because you don't learn anything. I'm so mad. I'll see you whenever I do my next video. I'm so mad. Okay. I've taken like half an hour to compose myself a little bit and uh, try to give a, a, a better review on uh, the three books that I read this month. I'm still mad about it um, and I don't know if that's gonna go away anytime soon but I'm gonna try <laughs> to be not horrible. So the books that I read this month are The Grim Grotto, The Penultimate Peril, and The End, all the series of unfortunate events, all by Lemony Snicket or Daniel Handler, I believe. I did pick the book up off the floor after I threw it. So I, until the end, until the end of the end, I was enjoying the books. I liked that they were no longer like the same predictable kind of retelling of the same story over and over again that the first couple were because I had trouble kind of wanting to continue the after reading like the first four or so books where it didn't feel like anything was really happening or being gained. Uh, ultimately, the books I know it had to have been intentional. There's no way that you accidentally don't tie up any of your loose ends. Uh, but <laughs> I that isn't how I want to end things. I have to know what happens with everything. Like, I'm someone who will go and like play a video game and then go on Wikipedia and read the entire story to make sure that I didn't miss something and so that I had a solid grasp of the plot and that I knew everything. So, uh, this series? Probably not for me. My friend ended up spoiling the whole Beatrice thing, um, and they were like, oh, it's common knowledge, and it's like, it was literally not explained until the last word of the book. It's not common knowledge. I mean, it, maybe if you read the books, then yeah. But if you didn't, you're awful. Don't spoil things. But I am thankful for these books in that they got me reading, because my goal, if you remember, back to my first booktube video, was to read, uh, one book a month. And I ended up reading ten books in three months, which is like I'm, I'm almost at the end of my goal for the year, which was 12 books, obviously, one book a month. You know, thanks books for getting me reading, even though I procrastinated it until the very end of the months to read them, uh, I still did read them, so I'm glad about that. Still mad about the ending, um, we'll see if, if that anger like dies down or, or like what'll change in uh, the Netflix series, maybe they'll do better. Please do better, please answer all of my questions. Also, can someone explain the spyglass telescope that's in the movie and the series because I'm pretty sure am I forgetting something because I don't think that was part of the books I don't know man I don't know in April I would like to uh read short standalone books one short standalone book even I don't want commitment right now <laughs> I'm I'm having some trust issues after what I've just experienced um and uh so yeah I'm gonna surprise y'all it's a real exciting surprise, I'm sure. Um, and I'll see you whenever I do my next video.